Hello, welcome to my channel where I have recently been doing a lot of reviews of the bath bombs that have jewelry in them. These one, this mostly having been the fragrant jewels. Today's is the spiced apple from the fall collection of fragrant jewels. Um, and the official sense of it, there's a lot of them, so bear with me. Our current clove bud, dragon fruit, acai berry, mango steen, apple, cinnamon, apricot, mango, peony, oh, can't see it, balsamic, tonka, oak, shredded coconut, and granola oats. Now, I'm not sure what half of those are supposed to smell like, but this smells very strongly of cinnamon and apples which I assume is what it's supposed to smell like. It's called spiced apples. Um, but it does also give me a very strong like remembrance of the toddy apple candles and lotions from Bath and Body Works. But enough talking. Here we go. All right. It is moving pretty quickly and it's wanting to run away. Here, I'm going to bring it a little bit closer. Okay, so the smell it is releasing is very strong. After like a bit of a three second wait period for it to actually start hitting me, um, like very, oh, very, very strong, like almost overpowering strong. Um, oh dear, come back, come back. Um, it is moving a lot. Like, that's kind of an understatement. It is really moving. Um, but it's also building up quite a bit of foam. The amount of foam that it's bringing up is reminding me strongly of the Earth Bath Bomb, which was the, fir which was the first bath bomb I got from them, from Fragrant Jewels. And it still, to this date, is my favorite. Um, oh, man, there's the cinnamon. Goodness, I feel like I am devouring one of those little Red Hot candies. The, no, fireball candies, that's what it is. Like, it's overpowering my nose and very strong. I can barely, I can basically taste it. It's so strong right now. Um, but it is turning the water a fireball red. Fun fact about those candies, I could never actually eat them all. So what I would do is I would dump it in water or I would like drop it in a water bottle I was drinking and then I would let it soak in it for a little bit and so the hot would kind of wind away and it would flavor the water, a very interesting flavor. And so that is how I would eat the fireball candies. Now, this, oh my goodness, it is so strong of a scent. I don't know if I'd be able to stand an entire bath in it. Um, like, I like the scent, but probably one of those that's for short periods of time only. And it is not turning my hand red. You might think it is, but that's just the look of it from the camera. Oh, I painted my nails today. Um, oh man, they're already chipping. Um, obviously, I'm not very good at painting my own nails, but oh, you can almost see the jewel inside. Oh, come off, come off the rest of you. Okay. So this is, ooh. Most of the spiced apple jewel, jewels I was really fond of and was excited about, which is kind of rare. Hold on, I'm having issues opening this. Come on. There we go. Okay, so this ring. Oh, I really like it. Um, as I was saying, most of the rings from this um, collection I really liked. Um, same with the falling leaves and the warm and cozy. I really liked all of the rings with them um, from the visual on the website, but this one, since the code is gold, means it is probably worth $25. I won't know if I want anything until I plug it in into the vault, but I'm not going to do that yet. I'm going to see how long I can stand this scent. Um, but yeah, this was the Spiced Apples review. I give it probably about mm, four stars. I would not use it again. In fact, I'm kind of dreading using the candle if this is any, um, so any preparation for 
what the candle smells like, but the candle will be able to disperse through a whole room, not just a small bathroom. So there is that perk to the candle. Um, but yeah, I do really like the ring. I will probably wear it tomorrow. Um, it's like a brown color. But yeah, so I give it a four because I don't like the smell too much for too long. It's really overpowering, which is kind of the opposite problem that I've been having recently. Normally they're pretty weak. Um, but I will not be purchasing this one again. Mm. I'll probably try to trade if I want the rest of the collection, but I tend to be okay with just one or two rings from each collection. There's The only one I might want the whole is the Falling Leaves, um, or one of the Christmas ones. They finally opened their holiday store, so I'm going to be looking at that as well. Um, but yeah, if you enjoyed this re ring reveal review thing, then please subscribe. Um, but yeah, <laughs> bye.